not so much, but there's still all to play for. So this is matches left the match everyone is waiting for. Sonic Fox Tekken Master, Group A, Ultimate Showdown. Both of them swept every single opponent so far. Some of you might have seen them. So this is the decision maker for who's going to get that first spot. People of Tekken Master back in the MKX, they have been rivals ever since, and that rivalry no doubt continues here. But the first time I've ever seen them so far, Raka Cyrex only. I think this is probably the first time they've ever played an MK1, so all eyes on this match for sure. Starting off strong though is Tekken Master and the hard to blockable already First time we see Tekken, Tekken Master, Master sweat. With that much needed combo breaker. Tekken Master is the kind of player who will be absolutely prepared though when it comes to tournaments. So I do wonder what Tekken Master has been cooking up strategy wise to dealing with this very prominent team of Sindel Kung Lao that isn't the most common team. There's only a handful of players that really play it. Sonic Fox obviously the one we see the most at the highest level these days. But uh, Tekken Master will be prepared. Gets the corner already though. We don't have a Cyrax to spend, and even if we did, I yep. think Tekken Master would have favored the chip damage afterwards. We're going back to that mid-screen. The dash-in breaker from Fox. The confidence has made comebacks from far bigger differences. Oh, tried to fish for that forward one again. Such a good normal. Not going to happen. Crucial flawless block again. And you notice, look at how long that cooldown is on that Cyrax chopper. Tekken Master cannot overcommit to anything right now. Oh, what a choice! I love that. Chooses to go for the spin the moment okay, Cyrax This, this match, like I, so I have goosebumps. Just waiting Literally out goosebumps the right now. Recharge, the two goats. And letting it go. Sonic Fox has so many good flawless blocks, but we are saying earlier how tough it can be to flawless block that spin in the air. The down one, but that will become safe thanks to that spin there from Cyrax. Sonic Fox with the armor is an interesting situation because should Sindel get the armored interruption on that down forward too, you're gonna get possibly a low hat situation. So the reward is gonna be more than just damage, and Tekka Master knows that. Oh, anti. the dash under? That would have been such a nice anti. Good yeah. anti but doesn't get the full yeah, combo for it. Break. Sonic Fox was 100% gonna pick up off that low hat. Ooh. Tried to armor, wow. but broke the armor. I love the timing of the call though on Tekken Master, so that armor didn't work. Obviously, didn't quite work out in the round, but Tekken Master with the knowledge. What it's something this time that Sonic Fox cleans up the round. It's something that's kind of rare from Baraka Cyrax. Even back when it was a lot more prominent, is that players would almost never go for the spin early to make the gap non-existent. Really, it's not something I've really seen. What's well, the trade-off, right? Like the earlier you call Cyrax Chopper, the less plus you will be at the end of the block string. So it's like you trade significant advantage for covering the the, you know, the gap that has good the jump armor. In. I think uh, something tried to enter. Just a pure jump in. Chopper break. I mean, pretty good for Tekken Master. He wasn't gonna turn that into a full combo. So getting three bars out of Sonic Fox is quite the victory. And these projectile trades will favor Baraka also. His Blade Spark does more damage. However, the jump in, that low hat isn't quite what it once was. But if you press a button, you're still landing on it and getting punished. But we've seen the reward Tekken Master will get. Yeah, Baraka, that, that jump is so strong, Ooh. but instant confirm. Oh no, a drop combo from Sonic Fox. Hang on. A lifeline for the Tekken Master. That is huge because you have missed out on so much setup. Uh -oh. Is that going to work? Yep, yep, yep. yep. Gonna work. Man, this fatal every right, single time when I see damage, it. But that chip damage Why is it full screen? Is activated and Cyrax has two stocks. But we've seen how good Sonic Fox has been at playing that distance game. So I, I don't imagine the chip damage will play too much of a factor here. Unless Tekken Master. Oh, I love that choice. Unless he does exactly what he just did. Instant Cyrax to cover the wake up, jumping behind it. That was so smart. And now, advantage Tekken Master. Oh, is that going to work? No! Doesn't. Tekken take the first one. Too slow, unfortunately. That idea was so good. But the spin was far too active. Can you believe that was just game one? I can. That was game one. I, I, I can because it's Sonic Fox and Tekken Master. Good morning, everyone. Right. But, but this, this and by a... everyone, I'm talking to this lovely crowd that we have here. No, this this is a crucial match though because we haven't mentioned Sexy it yet. Interrupt These are Sonic. two players in the group who are currently undefeated. Two set wins apiece, so whoever wins this will be the only undefeated player left in the group. And uh, I don't want to say guarantees them for the groups because the map escapes me, but definitely a pretty darn I mean, it good puts spot. Puts you in a bloody good situation, doesn't it? More about that later. The delay down or the back three. This time the Cyrax comes forward. 
Nothing really significant and a massive delay. That Cyrax isn't going to be back for some time. Tech Master has to navigate this minefield all on his lonesome. Oof! Oh, right, that's a good, good start there. Oh! oh, didn't get there in time to whiff punish, but Sonic Fox finished the string, anticipating the whiff punish. Getting the trade. Oh, full hit there, though. Not massive damage, but the corner. Both of these players won each round so bad. They break without hesitation. Well, they're two teams that don't exactly struggle to build meter, so I do understand it too, especially Baraka. Unless you're flawless blocking everything, he is going to just. There was, there was so far, max like, range there. Business. That was the safest thing he could do. If he dedicated to a button, that hat was going to hit him. He had to block it, and he had to just try and get maybe a flawless block or something. All right, hit confirmed there from Sonic Fox. What's it going to be? I'm sensing a low hat, maybe. I love that choice. Instant armor from Tekken Master. I always wonder if cancelling the float was maybe to bait that, but just could not land in time. Maybe. Either way, not that it matters. The Sonic Fox is looking really good in this game. Oh, and this time, let go of the low hat immediately. That, that would have been an armor break situation if Tekken Master hadn't delayed. Oh, hang on a minute. Yeah, has to break, but this is one-touch territory now for Sonic Fox. Tekken Master did go for the earlier Cyrax release to try and make it not as armorable, but it did result in a punish. Oof! Brave stuff. But with so much meter and so much life Something to work with, this is going to be yeah, it. One, one. so hard for Tekken Master. I saw it that is so impressive how Sonic, Fox, Sonic is able to You're adapt to all kind of different playstyles within a single round. Pretty dynamic match so far, though. Tekken Master doing a lot of jumps at that perfect range that we know. That you just you're looking to jump over fireballs, you're looking to jump over you know, the, the instant air, the lows, and on one good read, you're going to get a huge payoff for it, but. All right, here goes the barrage of standing fours. And if you do the down back one, it is gapless. And again, the instant break you were saying, not wanting to forego any of that advantage or life lead or anything like that. Ooh, back to back. Oh, wow. But now because of the break, not a lot of resources to extend off of that read, but still somewhat of a life lead. Ooh, that was beautiful. Over the bus like too. Choice. That jump back into spin is looking like a pretty reliable option here. Didn't even want to risk it. Didn't yeah. want to risk it, and I respect it. I'm just going to go back to mid-screen, please. Delayed grab. We've been actually been seeing this all day from Tekken Master. Whenever Tekken Master has a lead and a lot of advantage, just backing off with it. And normally, Baraka Cyrax, not a team with a significant amount of full screen presence, but Tekken Master, so confident in his patience as a player to make that distance work. Oh, what a block! I don't even know where that hit. But the meaty comes through and the breaker. Will Tekken Master use it? Chooses to. Risky business. Oh, that's gonna work! That's gonna work! No, it's, it's not gonna fast. work! Oh, it's too fast! I actually think that was a that was a spacing thing. I think like that was definitely in time to actually punish it, but not at that range, not get hit by the low hat, right? That would have had to have been further away, but Tekken Master went for it so close, but so far. I honestly Fox. totally understand Tekken Master going for it. That's actually something that he did at UFA consistently with the Johnny Cage teams with the Lao, was using it reactionarily. You've got to be so oh, fast with that, in. but either right, we'll way, Tekken in the blender and Taps is here oh, too, guys. Armor broken. This is going to be the round, actually. <laughs> 2-1 now. Well, folks, the, these Fox. boys, they are gaming today. Like, these matches are wild. Faisal's super, super nervous. Lost a few matches already, but 1-1 one, one versus Shinnok. But right now, Sonic, te Sonic Tekken Master, we don't even have to talk about this. When you're playing a team like this, the Sindel Lao, so good at... Right now, Sonic in the lead, I think. Tekken really Master won the first match. More damage, but or the first round. Can at times be a bit iffy to find the hit at distance, but... Yep. I think with this kind of match... The adaptation is wild. Just trading at range so much. Sonic Fox swept Faisal. And they'll low whatever it is. Like, that eventually you're gonna close the distance. You know, Barakas, unless he's got a massive lead, he's gotta go in at some point. Wait. And if you have like the armor oh, breaks, I'm sorry. Ready to go. They can hear now, perhaps. Oh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> Hi, guys. Back to the match we go. Take him as a Sonic on match point. Like Barakas, Tarak. Oh, my God. He's just finding a snowball rolling and it just gets bigger and bigger. There's a whip punish. 
Now back to Ooh, character big. select, just to give a little bit of time, I think, for Tekken Master. Just go for a bit of a refresh before we go into what could be our final game here. Sonic's re Sonic really is the big adaptation in, master. The safety, Fox. Did you lose Fox the first game? The ground. Yep, but only the first one. And then, the grab, and then already, like, bit more two safe, up. Wow. Sonic does say Sindel uh, Lau is the best team alongside Johnny Chameleon, and I'm like, Ooh, okay, Nice me. catch there. Better than nothing. That would have been a whiff otherwise. Tekken Master. Oh, that throw tech so quick. Oh, look how easy the action movement. Wake up, Wake up buttons, buttons versus Tekken Master is a different kind of evil. Like, uh, I, I, I love how... Sonic just Not reads your movement so moment. well. Even Again, on Wake Up, I, it's, it's insane. Oh, that's insane. Oh, no <gasps> that is such a big mistake, leaving so much damage on the table. to say the least, because now, I mean, last breath isn't going to apply in this matchup. We're not on the final round. You can't get hit. Wait, on, no way, on, no way, no way. Yep, Fox has to break. He can't take a projectile from Trader Blade anymore. But you can't take low hat, that's the problem. You can't take any yeah. damage. Oh! Dead. Caught with the down three and match point Sonic Fox. I get it. You know that Tekken Master was trying to flawless block those projectiles, but just couldn't find it. Oh, sorry. We'll get got Tarek's hit as well. Look how he oh, no. just reads your approach so yeah, well. I don't understand how Sonic does it. On the like... He's not going to be back for a while. There he is. But Ooh, that was insane. I mean, he's out for the count. He might be gone for the rest of this match, depending on Sonic Fox momentum. Keep this combo. Right, we're gonna get some and Sonic always has like meter advantage, man. He, he's so he's insane at meter managing. Yeah, he is not using a lot of resources no for his we combos at all. He's always saving the meter. No class blocks, though. Oh, interesting. We trade the projectiles. That's good for Tekken Master. That wait, is, oh, wait. That is so he has fatal blow, by the way. He has fatal. Okay, just cashing out on damage. I don't believe yeah, this I like does this enough, approach. but this will leave Tekken Master low enough that low hat's a threat. Any individual yeah. projectiles a threat. Chip damage could be. He a wants problem. to put Tekken Master in a position where Tekken Master can fatal blow Sonic's projectiles and kill with fatal. You know. The flip side, one reactionary fatal so now, will kill Sonic Fox as well. No, but it's gonna trade. It's not gonna work. Yeah, Sonic that was good. Made it three one over Tekken Master. Wow. So Wait, did he also beat Faisal? Yes. Oh yeah, Sonic took that. Sonic won every single set finish. so far. Like, Sonic, Sonic is back at being the, the number one, man. It's crazy. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. And this was a group people were looking at going into this weekend being like, yeah.